once you have downloaded the IMA Explorer app from the repo, you can launch the IMA Explorer app, perform a guest login to start connecting to many different databases for climate risk data. The IMA Explorer app will then open. You can select the specific environment you'd like to choose. In our case, we're going to say NGFS Scenario Explorer. We can select the model we'd like to use, the scenario we'd like to investigate, and different variables we'd like to look at. So in our case, maybe we'd like to look at secondary energy electricity, and we can load and preview this data, and it will fetch the data and forecasts from the database for us. We can select many different models or different countries that we'd like to investigate this data first. And because we are from South Africa, we can go and select Southern Africa. Maybe we'd also like to view China and Colombia, for instance, and we can get those different forecasts that are associated with this database we are exploring. We can then select this data to go to the workbook so we can do some further analysis. In the search tab, you might, might want to do the same thing, but just to look at more, more different or more variations of data. You can go to the workbook and start investigating your data in more detail. You can select different types of charts. You can maybe want to see a bar stacked chart and you can then see the plots and analysis. But once you have this data, maybe you want to perform additional analysis. Maybe you'd like to do a climate stress test or determine what the portfolio weightings need to be in the future based on this data. You can then ex export this data to the workspace and start performing those analysis with the data in your MATLAB workspace. And catch us in the next video to see how you can use this data in some of your analyses.